This video is presented by the Moffitt Cancer Center Rehabilitation Department. Now that you've had hip surgery, your body needs time to heal. Until then, some simple everyday movements can damage the surgical repairs. The hip is a joint that allows motion between your trunk and your leg. This video will teach you the right way to move after hip surgery. For now, there are three movements you should avoid. 1. Do not cross your surgery leg past the middle of your body at any time, whether standing, sitting, or lying down. This could easily happen while lying down if you roll on your side with your surgery leg on top. Keep pillows between your knees to keep your legs apart when you roll. 2. Do not let your hip bend to a V-shape as the person is doing here. The red lines show the V-shape between your trunk and leg. You may bend your hip as far as an L-shape or 90 degrees. The correct shape is shown by the green lines. To avoid a V-shape, keep a tall posture when standing. Sit on elevated surfaces such as a high toilet and use a pillow on your car seat as needed. Use helpful tools for reaching, such as a long-handled reacher or sock aid. Some of these tools can be found at local pharmacies, medical equipment, or home improvement stores. Or you can search the web for daily living aids. 3. Keep your surgical leg from turning inward. Do not let toes point to your other leg. As you turn your body, be sure to turn your foot so the toes keep facing forward. Questions? Your occupational and or physical therapist is here to help.